Welcome back, I'm Brett Thomas, and this is what we've been talking about all day long here. This is Plaza Towers, and that used to be their parking garage underneath the building here. As you can see, it is full of water right now. There's a trash bin right there that they weren't able to get out of the way before the water rose too high. Another trash bin right here, and you see this big pipe running up to one of the biggest water pumps you'll ever see. That thing's been running for quite a time, quite all day, essentially. That pipe, it's snakes all the way out, it dumps out into the river here. The reason why they're doing that, obviously, is because they have so much water in here, but if you'll uh, take a look, I've got kind of a low-tech explanation here for you. This is that flood wall we've been talking about all this time that rings Grand Rapids, essentially. Well, this is, would be the river. There's a crack in the bottom of this parking garage, and water is just screaming out of it. It's all coming in because there's so much pressure here. Water coming here, groundwater, it's all basically being pushed down and pushed back up and filling it up. Well, the idea is they're gonna let that water stay about this level because they wanna be able to equalize the river water with the water in the basement so it'll help fortify this flood wall. So they're gonna keep pumping water out but only so fast that they don't draw it all the way down until the river comes down. And when the river goes down, they'll start drawing water out down here. We've got this kind of situation going on at several other uh, hotels and big buildings in Grand Rapids. Obviously, see something we're going to continue to follow. We'll let you know any new developments. Stay with us. Our next newscast is at 11 o'clock tonight, 10 o'clock on WXSP.